Today, a judge ruled that strip clubs in San Diego can stay open despite the state's stay at home order. Then just hours ago, one county leader claimed that that decision extends to all restaurants as well. And while there are still questions about the legality of that claim, the county has suspended enforcement against all eateries. News 8's Richard Allen joins us now with what we know so far. Richard. Well, that's right. The county confirms that while it's still analyzing the judge's ruling and trying to get clarity from the court, for the time being, it is suspending enforcement activities against restaurants and strip clubs. I was ecstatic for these for these businesses. County Supervisor Jim Desmond calls today's ruling coming as the Pfizer vaccine is being rolled out as a double win for restaurant owners. It, it means they can they can open up and get their livelihoods back. It means they have. It means they have the same opportunities that the other businesses had to safely open. Under this preliminary injunction, the state and county are prohibited from enforcing California's stay-at-home order against strip clubs Cheetahs and Pacers, provided established precautions are taken. Legal analyst Dan Eaton. What the judge essentially said is, the county hasn't shown any connection between the offering of live entertainment with restaurant service and the spread of COVID-19 uh, in such a way that it will uh, impact uh, ICU capacity. The ruling also applies to San Diego County businesses with restaurant service, although it's not clear which businesses that applies to. This is at odds with a ruling in a separate court case last month brought forth by restaurant Cowboy Star that denied a request for restaurants and gyms to reopen under the stay-at-home order. For now, uh, the uh, two cases are proceeding in very different ways before different judges uh, in the same county. Eaton also cautioned that Wednesday's ruling is specific to the case presented by Cheetahs and Pacers. It would be a mistake to assume that simply because these strip clubs uh, won uh, this preliminary uh, injunction that uh, any other establishment is also going to be able to reopen. Nevertheless, the county has decided for the time being to suspend enforcement activities against restaurants and strip clubs. Keep in mind, though, the state and county have the power to appeal today's decision, a move they are widely expected to take.